mentors welcome to engineer hash civil engineer in this video i am going to explain you about aqueducts well most of the people get confused with this figure this is not a complete aqueduct this is just an aqueduct bridge it is part of an aqueduct this is not a complete aqueduct let's understand how a complete aqueduct looks like if you look at the definition Aqueduct is a water course constructed to carry water. Aqueduct is a water course. It is not a single independent structure. It is a water course. It has a group of structures like tunnels, aqueduct bridges, canals and pipes etc. If you look at the Latin etymology of an aqueduct, aqua means water and duce means to lead. Aqueduct is a structure which leads water from the source to the demand. We find construction of aqueducts from ancient times itself. Why? Why they have got so much importance? Why we need aqueducts? Because every place don't have equal water resources. Some places lack water for commercial needs, some places lack water for irrigation needs, some places even don't have water for drinking. So to cater these needs, aqueducts carry water from the source to the demand. Using this group of structures like tunnels, aqueduct bridges, canals and pipes. Well. Theoretical definition of an aqueduct is very simple like aqueducts carry water from source to the demand under gravity but in construction it is not so it is very very complex because let me explain how aqueducts run for number of hundreds of kilometers of stretches just think how to maintain that very minute slope how how much difficult it is to maintain that minute slope there where the magnificency of the aqueducts lies and if you look at the ancient aqueducts the water is flown from this top side the section of this looks like this where the water is carried through this narrow passage in the middle under gravity and we find ancient aqueducts in countries like Greece, Egypt and Rome even some Asian countries like India and Sri Lanka also have ancient aqueducts and these arches are just to save the material if you look at the modern aqueducts water is carried under pipes under gravity we use pipes because uh, they reduce the losses and in modern times the largest aqueducts of all have been built in United States of America to supply countries biggest cities like California and this picture is from can uh, water carrying for California we also have navigable aqueducts where the aqueducts also cater the need of navigation well this is rare but yeah and if you like this video please hit like button and please subscribe my channel my channel is completely new please help it and you can subscribe my channel engineer hash civil engineer and you can send me feedback at this email id thank you very much